Yo, how's it going guys? It's your boy Raptor here. Today I'm bringing you guys another story video and I don't want to seem like I'm blowing you guys up with story videos. It's just Call of Duty's been really boring recently so I can't really do cut comms or anything like that. And I don't want to make another vlog either because then it'll just be the same vlog over and over again. So instead I'm just going to do some story videos and I think you guys kind of enjoy these ones. So anyways, you guys may or may not know this, but I don't have many friends over, and it's not because I'm anti-social or anything, it's just because I, I kind of wish to be alone most of the time and just talk to my friends on Skype. That and it's just a lot easier anyways, because I always have bad stuff that happens whenever friends come over, or whenever I go over to friends' houses. So this story actually takes place at about 5th or 6th grade, and it's probably one of my more crazier stories. So one of my really good friends at the time, we're going to give him a name, we're going to call him Dexter. His birthday was coming up soon, so he wanted to celebrate it by uh, throwing a birthday party and inviting a couple friends. So I thought, okay, this is going to be really fun then. And one of my other friends, we're going to call him, uh, we're going to call him Jonathan. Yep, good old Jonathan. So me and Jonathan were like really, really good friends at the time. So I was invited to Dexter's birthday, and immediately I had to call Jonathan. I was like, yo, Jonathan, are you going to Dexter's birthday party? It's going to be sick. And he told me that he lost his invite, so he didn't know what the time and everything was. And so I was telling him everything, the time, location, all of that kind of info to go to his birthday party. So fast forward a little bit, the birthday party comes, and it was more of a sleepover birthday party. So me and Jonathan arrive at Dexter's house. And we're like so pumped to just like go into his basement and play video games all night. And it was just going to be awesome. Turns out, Jonathan actually didn't even have an invite. Wow, what the fuck, Jonathan? But yeah, so uh, Dexter's mom just let him stay anyways. She was pretty cool with it. Actually, I don't know what I'm talking about. She was probably really mad about it. Anyway, so one of uh, Dexter's other friends, we're gonna call him Six. Now Six, imagine that weird kid at your school, but one who's like really annoying and just ticks everyone off and just ruins everything for everyone. That's who Six was. So the whole time, Six was just being a nuisance and just kind of annoying everyone else because everyone else had kind of matured up a little bit and wasn't annoying everyone else. And we were all just trying to play video games, but he was annoying everyone. So it got to the point where everyone at the party had ganged up on Six. So a few hours go by, Six goes to bed. So a few hours go by and Six goes to sleep. Everyone else was still awake. There was maybe like three other people there, but they weren't really in the story. So at this point, it's pretty much just me and Jonathan playing Xbox, and Dexter is upstairs playing with all his presents and stuff like that that he got from people. Me and Jonathan were cool with it though, I mean we were doing our own things, so we were all having fun. And I guess one of the presents that Dexter got was like this huge die that you could actually sit on. And what I mean by die is like the things that you roll in the board games. One of those things that you could actually sit on. It turned into this capture the flag mission where we had to go and find this thing in his house. And we had to like take it from him. Now it wasn't stealing. It was more of like taking it and then like running away with it and then giving it back whenever he gets it back. So it wasn't like bad taking. But we were all just having fun, you know. So we're pretty much doing that for a couple hours and then a few hours go by and Dexter finally just crashes. So by this time it was me, Jonathan, and the few other people that were still awake. The one kid was playing Minecraft, me and Jonathan were still playing Xbox or whatever. And we decided then to just kind of jump on the mattress that that would be a good idea. Because it was like a pull out couch so the mattresses aren't the best quality. But I don't know, that's just what we decided to do. We were going to have fun with it. So we ended up jumping on it, and uh, we just kept doing it for like literally 30 minutes. It was really fun. Then we eventually just stopped because uh, we just decided it was kind of getting boring. So then we just went back to playing video games and stuff like that. A few hours go by, and we decide to crash. We decide, all right, we're getting bored. Let's just go to bed. So when we wake up, Jonathan is like in tears because he's so bored and he wants to go home. And then Six is still annoying everyone. Actually, I think he was the first one to leave that morning, which was really good for us anyways. So me and Jonathan just keep going back to playing video games in the morning just to kind of get his mind off of stuff. But then we end up stop playing video games again, and guess what we start doing again? We start jumping on the mattress again. And because this time Dexter's mom is awake, she comes down and stops us and realizes that we just completely bent up the mattress. So we were kind of banned from doing that. So I think then we were just kind of watching some really dumb stuff on YouTube. But then I guess Dexter's mom had put up decorations and stuff for the birthday party. So we start ripping them down from the ceiling and stuff like that. I don't know why we decided to do this. It wasn't a very good idea. But we just kept doing it, right? It was fun. 
And Dexter's mom came down and was completely ticked at me and Jonathan for doing this. So she just like really wanted us to get out of her house pretty much. So the rest of the time until we got picked up, it was pretty much just pure awkward silence because we didn't want to do anything. And we were bored of video games and we just didn't want to get in trouble anymore. So yeah, we just completely sat in awkward silence. I mean, the rest of that day was pretty normal. We just uh, went home and then we didn't get punished for it, thank God. But I have been pretty much banned from his house since then, so I mean, that kind of sucks. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little birthday party going wrong video. If you guys did, smash the like button below. And I'll see you next time. Peace out. Lifestyles of the broken famous Trying to figure out what my goals and aims is Going down a road that I know is tame